We've had science for, let's say, since Newton or Copernicus, 500 years at most. And look what we've done. We've, we've gone beyond the solar system with Voyager. We've walked on the moon. Um, we've, we're, we're about to go to Mars, I would think. So we're about to begin colonizing our own solar system. We've done that in 500 years. <laughs> so imagine a million years right. in the future. It's one of the arguments often used to say there aren't any civilizations out there in the galaxy. It's called the Fermi paradox. Because if you imagine a civilization that's a million years ahead of us, they should have written their presence across the sky by now. They should, you should see them. Mm. I mean, you'll see us. If we survive a million years into the future, actually even a few thousand years into the future, we will be exploring the galaxy. We will have spacecraft that are going to the stars. We will be doing it. So our signature will become visible, I'm sure, if we last. Like if there is a civilization that's a million times more advanced than us and mm. been around here for you know millions of years of life as opposed to quarter million, why would they let us know?